Friends stay close. Friends in the tribe, stay closer. In the tribe, you always know what's up with Facebook, WhatsApp, BB, and Twitter. There are no rules with SMS. It's endless. Enjoy very long conversations with that special someone. Enjoy endless connections to your friends with free calls, free WhatsApp, Twitter, Facebook, and BBM. You also enjoy up to 200% bonus on your recharges to call all networks. Migrate now by dialing star 312 hash and start a live. Endless connections. Airtel, the smartphone network. Welcome to another awesome episode of Trending brought to you by Airtel. Trending shows here on Hip TV, DSTV channel 324 every day at 9 a.m. and 8 p.m. This is a show that brings you everything and everyone buzzworthy. Well, my name is Nancy Isime and just in case you are still wondering who I am, well, I am your new host for Trending. It's going to be a remarkable time and I can't wait to bring you all the fun and excitement to all of you watching right now. Okay, back to the show. My guest today is a fast rising star who gets everyone laughing with his really, really hilarious Instagram videos. Well, his new single has been making waves since its release. I know you're still thinking, who is this person? Well, while you're thinking, I would go on a break now. When we come back, you get to meet him. Stay with me. Igwe, igwe, igwe. Say, you know, say with just 200 naira recharge card, Etel they summer me with 200% bonus to yam more with any network. <laughs> Relax. In fact, I don't buy your own address in my video. Anytime I recharge 200 naira and above, Smart Connect they summer me with free internet by your address in today. <laughs> Airtel, the smartphone network. And we are back. It's still trending on Hip TV channel 324 on DSTV, brought to you by Airtel. In case you just tuned in, you were spot on because I was about to reveal my guest for today. It's no other than the bad guy himself. Files, well, it's so good to have you on the show. <laughs> How are you? Uh, <clears throat> I'm very excited to be here. Uh, you know, I, as you, I don't know, you, you may have observed it, but television is my hobby. So this is going to be an opportunity for me to be once again behind the camera. In fact, it's a wonderful stuff. So wonderful. What happened? Your mouth is open. What happened? Uh, okay. I just are, was are not. I am just a little surprised, but it's fine. A surprise is part of the show, so it's okay. Well, this is a segment. You look good, by the way. I love the whole. Thank you so much. Elo Bay. Elo Bay t shirt. Yeah. Go and get yours if you have not observed it yet. Make sure you get it. Is, is this your. Do you, did you design it? Uh, yeah, actually. Uh, but it's actually in collaboration with a already established brand. Okay. Yeah, called J. Osby. So it's not like collaboration, collaborative line. It's not like my own design. I'm not a designer, okay? But I'm doing collaboration with a designer okay. to establish a t-shirt line. Called Elobe. Elobe. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Now, this is a segment of the show called Style Updates. Yeah. You know, where you get to talk about what you're wearing and tell us the inspiration behind it. Yeah. Where, uh, my healthy for today, you know, we like to keep it simple. We don't do too much. We don't do too much, especially when we are on television. Today, uh, just as I explained, I'm wearing a little t shape uh, mm -hmm. by Jay Osby and Files the Bad Guy. Uh, <laughs> exactly. And I'm wearing uh, just a light blue jean. I'm on jean today. Okay. Uh, I'm also on a, some ply, uh, just a, a, a what, do, what do they call it? It's a subtle kind of a boot. Uh, this, this one is just something that at least people from abroad used to wear. Yeah, so it's just something that I believe that at least is appropriate for this occasion for the decade. Yes, because you know there's winter here, yeah, so it's yes. really snowing in the studio. No, it doesn't necessarily have to be winter's call. It's a fashion stop. 
the fashion is tough. So if somebody that is fashionable in Asia, we understand where I'm coming from. <laughs> yes. It's very nice taking. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. At least people used to comment me that I'm fashioning star, but I don't know. Maybe in the nearest official, I can be on the wrong way. I'm still, you're still looking at it. I'm still looking at it. You want to be a model? Possibly. Are, are you trying to say I don't have the body? Ah, when did I say that? You no, have the perfect body. Hey, fact, thank you so much. I mean, you have to, in fact, you, we need you. Thank you so much. You also have a nice body yourself, <laughs> if I can say so. Thank you. Yes. Yeah, I'm blushing. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's get down to business. I, yes. I can't wait to dig into our conversation. I know that your real name is Falari Falano. Yeah. And um, your stage name is Fals. So how did you come about that? Fals, Fals, Fals. Well, uh, short form of my last name, you know, picked it up while I was in school, secondary okay. school. You know, it's just that Ali, my friends, is always calling me then. It's just like Ali, they just... They believe he's a nice alias, mm -hmm. you know, somebody that is a was up guy, he need to have a guy name. So they just believe that that is something they can give to me. I also accept it because I like the, the way it's hand. And as life progresses, generally, they now have a title to it. If I was the bad guy. What? Understand me? So, be, because of my persona, there's a certain swagger about me. Oh. Anytime I'm in the area, you will know he's here. <sighs> So that is why they yeah, called me. I knew when Nairobi came into the building. Yeah, so you are very correct. Yeah, thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Now, I want to know about you, your education. What do you know about me, my personal life? No, we'll get there. Okay. Calm down. Okay. Your educational background for okay, now. First, okay, first. Yes, first. first. Where are uh, education? Education. You studied law? I did study. Contrary to public opinion, public belief is that I'm illiterate. I didn't go to school, but I need to clear the air today. Uh, primary school was in Lagos, uh, St. Louis. It's a Catholic school. It's in Ikeja over there. Okay. Uh, then secondary school, uh, Olashiro International School, Ocean State. Okay. Then university. My university is UK, okay. University of Reading. Okay. Yeah, so at least for the people out there that I think that maybe I, I have not traveled before, it's a lie. I'm even from there. I'm from there. So at least after university, I then come back. And brought the boots. Exactly. So I went to Nigerian law school in Abuja, qualified as a barrister, called to the bar 2012. Yes. I'm here today. I'm a qualified barrista. So what part about music? Like your Music is passion. Music is passion. When you are passionate about something, you will follow your heart. We follow your heart. As long as you are somebody that is having a serious mind, you will have to follow your heart. So music is passion for me and that is why I'm here. So with this educational background, how did you manage to this accent, or how did you acquire it? Did it take you days and nights to, you know? The other thing, the other thing, I, I mean, it's something that I just pick up, I just pick up, I think mean, that people around me, my immediate environment, I mean, growing up in school, you know, there, there's no more people that you'll be surrounded with. I'm sure you have these people in your life. You don't have any, everybody from your house is posh. Yeah, house. Everybody around you is posh. Not really there will be people, people. There will be so much people around that I need. I just start from the anointing, and you know, yeah, I have to do. All right, guys, it's time for our fast fire question segment, where I get to ask our guest questions, which you'd answer under sixty seconds. Okay. I'm rooting for you on this. Okay, let's do this. I'm ready. Are you ready? Yes. All right, let's go. What's your birthday month? October. Do you prefer baths or shower? Shower. Do you have any eye defects? Nope. Right or left handed? Right hand. Favorite fruit juice? Apple. What was the last film you watched? Mm, 30 Days in Atlanta. Do you have any scars? Yes. Can you curl your tongue? Your tongue? Can I roll it? Can you curl it? Nope. Oh, okay. I'm hoping you could. Is your belly button an inny or outy? <laughs> inny. <laughs> what was the last song you danced to? Pff, uh, I don't remember. Do you wear sunglasses indoors to look cool or stylish? I never wear sunglasses. Mm. Are you good at keeping secrets? Yes. Introvert or extrovert? Introvert. Do you buy any weekly or monthly magazines? Nope. What was the last piece of clothing you purchased? I can't remember. Mm, 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 60 seconds. Mm. I, tried, I tried, I tried. No, but you tried. That was really yeah. good. Like how many questions did I answer? You answered all. Ah, well, you yeah. answered, you didn't answer about two. 
but yeah. you answered it was like you were able to do everything so you can't call your, your tongue i mean I, I i thought the one you were asking was the the upward one i can do this one is that that's what? A, that's, that's a talent. Okay. Yeah. That's a, that's a talent. So I'm trying. You I'm have trying. something to fall back on yeah. and get through. I don't know if there is any money to be made with this talent, though. Like, nowadays, there's so much money to be made from me. Mm. It's just, I'll hook you up. Okay. Let's okay. talk after the show. All right. All right. So do you have any scars? You answered that, but I do have scars. Them? Where's that from? <sighs> terrible car accident. Uh, last, you no, know, 2013 November. Uh, terrible car accident. I was. Um, in Abuja, I was on my way to Benin by road. Uh, turned out to be a terrible idea because we got robbed and, well, we got shot at. Uh, armed robber in the middle of the highway, shot at the car. Uh, we didn't even realize because uh, we were sleeping at the, at the moment, um, at the time. Yeah. Then they shot at the car. One of the bullets hit the driver. And the driver died instantly. Oh! My God, yeah, this yeah. sounds like a scene from Hollywood. It was, it was horrible. It was horrible. And uh, he lost control of the car, obviously. And then the car crashed straight, <coughs> straight into the bush. Because it was, you know, off the highway into, yeah. into the bush. So he hit a tree. And, and then that was it. I thought I was going to die. I thought I was going to die. But, you know, so I, I took this position. And that's how I got the scar. Because the... uh screen? The main screen, exactly. I was at the back of... But that just shows like how you know the grass was everywhere. So I just you know sort of took this position. I'm like, okay, this is it. And if I'm gonna die, let me die. If I'm going. I mean, we can laugh about it now, but at the time it was it, it was it was a horrible experience. And you know, my manager broke his leg. He had to do surgery. He still has a metal in his leg right now. Oh. Yeah. Um, yeah, it was it, it was crazy because they still came to the car even after the crash. Did they now? Yeah. yeah. Where's the money? Where's the money? I say bye bye. There is no money. <laughs> I was pretty much. I was more shocked than anything. Else. That's yeah, yeah. Because at this point you. So what? What is really going on? It's it just crashed. It, I just almost died. I'm not dead. Is somebody really dead in the same car? Exactly. That you know, all, all of these things went through my head at the time. So it was, it's, it was a terrible spell. So I mean, at, at the end of this, in fact, it's compulsory that we go to church for Thanksgiving. We did, we did it. We did it. We did it. Thanksgiving is so much necessary, and because we realize that it is not a joke at all. And you know, the Lord really saved us from something so strong. How did you guys get out of there? Because we first crashed. And that's the reason. This is Nigeria. Yes. Yeah. We really need to do something about this situation because at the time we were getting robbed. We heard something that sounded like a siren. So in my mind, I was like, ah, well, well police is coming. Gang, gang, something. But those guys heard it as well. Then they started shooting. Quack, 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 like a shoot in the air. And the siren just off. It just off. And that was it. Automatic. So until they were done with what they were doing, and they went away for like 10 minutes later before, you know, police showed up. Some soldiers as well. And they were like, hey, what are they? What are they? I see this one. Same trick after everything that happened. Well, you know, police guys, you know, just helped us go to the nearest hospital. This was a town called Abaji. Where is that? Just right after Lokoja. Okay. We, had, we had left Abuja, we had passed Lokoja, mm -hmm. but we hadn't gone to the next uh, state, so it was somewhere in between. So in Abaji, we got treated, had to be referred back to Abuja, uh, General Hospital. You know, we were there for a while, there for a while. You know, because obviously uh, it was a fracture, so the, uh, my guy had to do his surgery. But um, it was, I mean, it was, it was an interesting, um, not interesting actually, yeah, yeah, it's, it's an interesting story, terrifying. but it was a terrifying experience it's at the time. Yeah. When, how long ago was this? This was, uh, that was about a year, that was about a year, 2013 November. So I think it's 2014 November, we did something like a celebration of life, because it's nice and straight, it's nice and straight. Wow. Yeah. I'm really shaking by this story that I have to go on a break. But while I go on this break, you guys will check out what's trending. And when we come back, Fowles and I will talk about what is trending on social media. We learn for that. Okay. We'll be right back. Hi. What's trending? We brought you news yesterday about the massive foil scarcity biting deep in the country. But fortunately, the strike that led to the scarcity has been suspended. Hopefully, the country will be back to its novel state soon. However, we want you to prepare for the infinitely long queues at filling stations 
till the fuel generously circulates. Friends stay close. Friends in the tribe stay closer. In the tribe, you always know what's up with Facebook, WhatsApp, Phoebe, and Twitter. There are no rules with SMS. It's endless. Enjoy very long conversations with that special someone. Enjoy endless connections to your friends with free calls, free WhatsApp, Twitter, Facebook, and BBM. You also enjoy up to 200% bonus on your recharges to call all networks. Migrate now by dialing star 312 hash and start a life. Endless connections. Airtel, the smartphone network. Welcome back. It's still trending on Hip TV, brought to you by Etel. And just in case you're just joining us, I have Files here with me, and we were talking about some of the things you guys are talking about on social media. Okay. And how can we talk about what's trending without talking about a little bit? You invented a trend that got people talking, and they have not gotten over it. So, what inspired a little bit? Well, uh, uh, basically, you, you know, uh, prior to the putting out of this channel uh, on my uh, via my social media page, yes. I have been putting out a, a series of skits, okay, mm -hmm. with a certain premonition that is introduction mm -hmm. that goes towards a little bit. So therefore, I thought of the, the okay, this is something that is naturally already becoming a scam, scam world. You know, people is using it. So why don't I create something I can do? In that Valentine period is coming that time. Yes. We now just thought, okay, initiative. Now, get your fans, follow at everybody in this life mm. to send a video, send a message to their loved one. It will be something nice mm. but funny. Yes. Okay? It will be something with their length. Yeah. So everybody is now attempting this kind of their length. So imagine the kind of chaos that is on the internet. <laughs> in fact, it was crazy. So much of entry, so much of you know, uh, funny stuff. And then the winner was entitled to a weekend stay in certain prestigious hotel on Thailand. Uh, also, free ride throughout the weekend and a dinner for two on Valentine's Day. So, if you win the challenge, you can get to have dinner with pay and a special weekend in a prestigious hotel. So, that is what happened. And you know, at the end of the challenge, we got one of the funniest videos that I have seen in quite a while. Really? <laughs> yeah. And you know, he was able to win the, the first prize. Mm -hmm. And actually, that was not her. The five funniest videos are also entitled to iPhone 6. Exactly, iPhone 6. So, this, you know, just to show that I think everybody is still a winner. Yes. Everybody is still a winner. Yes. And even on Valentine's Day, the, the 20 funniest videos, mm -hmm. the people that you know, make them. I hung out with them, with the intimate guy friend, I leave. So they are my father time for that day. Oh, so there was no idea of it for you. It just no, the fans, fans is big. My fans is big. Fans is big, that's a nice, yeah. that's a nice one. There's something I've always wondered, and this is a personal question from me to you, and I think a lot of your fans would probably want to know as well. Do you think that um, your um, Instagram videos, the viral ones, brought you more fame? than music itself Oof, it's a difficult stuff it's a difficult stuff uh to be frank to be frank with you uh -huh. i think is it's about the character it's about the character all in me now people some people is open to it based on the music okay yeah. some people is able to perceive this character uh -huh. based on my music uh -huh. now exposing or expressing or entering this character the more uh -huh via my social media platform yeah. okay bringing him out showcasing him to the world i think definitely make people to connect mm -hmm. connect more directly yes. with the character and this is being about a certain certain what is the word for it curiosity okay like who is this guy? What exactly. what, what is this problem? Out, he actually sings and he has music already out there and he's already exactly. a successful music artist. Exactly. Because when most people see most celebrities, they always feel like you know the whole glitz and glamour to them. Yeah. And then they notice someone who is speaking very, you know, with an accent, yeah. and they say, "Oh, this is the same guy Falls yeah. that sang the song." Are exactly. you kidding? Like, yeah. I didn't know he could sing. So he, 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 you know, he then bring about a you know yeah. a certain curiosity and much more interest. So I think the, this is how it worked out. Yes, so you think it's brought you more fame? Definitely. Music uh, it, 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 it added to the fame. Yeah. 
Let me okay. put it like that. De- okay. Definitely. Okay, so it's a plus. It's amazing. It's a, it's a massive plus. It's amazing. Massive amazing. plus. Yeah. Now, Hello has open doors for the closing line. What's next are you going to? Well, uh, you know, we're just trying to to franchise it. Hello Bay is more than just a a song, more than just a single. It's mm-hmm. a it's a brand. It's a franchise. You know, we're going to continue to be you know leveraging on this. The single is doing very so much well. Uh, mm-hmm. so in the nearest official, the official video will be coming. Oh, it's coming out soon? Oh, definitely. I want to be in it. Why not? Feel free to be in it. I will send you the invite. I will. What will I play? What would you like to play? Feel free to choose your role. Hello, Bay. You want to be the Bay, go, go, go. Yes, fans is Bay. Why not? I want to be the fans, that you, is Bay. You'll be Bay, you'll be Bay. Let's do this. Okay. We'll bring you the video when it comes out. <laughs> okay, well, since you're so content with like, social media, we have a segment which is called the My Kana Tribe segment. Now this was coined out of Airtel's new campaign, My Tribe, where you get exciting bonuses and allow you better and longer access on social media and instant messages. Now we'll be playing a game to test you folks. We want to know how much you know about social media applications. So my, tribe, my tribe is your bad tribe. Is, is, is that a game? No. Okay. I want to know how much you know about social media applications. Oh, okay. I, I'm a well. pro at this. Okay, so let's go there. Yeah. Let's go. TBH. To be honest. IKR. I know, right? TTYL. Talk to you later. Excuse me? Who brought you Expo? I did chat. I did chat with it. YW. YW. Why do you mean? No, why W? Ah, don't know that one. Why W means what you doing? No, why W? Oh, why W? Sorry, 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 sorry. You're welcome. No, I was thinking W Y. You're welcome. Why W? You're welcome. Yeah. I'm really open. Yeah. I know it's yeah, right. You're welcome. You're welcome. Please, you're welcome. I can't even give you something. No, no, no. Is that all? Are you asking me more? That's all. Just that one. Just do this one. Huh? Just Happy birthday. LLMP. Long life of prosperity. Eh? Oh, God go make you bigger. Ah, ah, I'm a champ. Which is HH? Hello? Be be hooray. Oh. You know, you have to send everything to me, right? You get a little bit of 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 we won that round. Give it to you, give it to you. But um, we need to go to break now. Alright. And when we come back, it will be time for nasty comments. Oh, I'm not going to be a good 
Percent bonus to yam more with any network. <laughs> Relax. In fact, I don't buy your own address in Nigeria. <laughs> Anytime I recharge 200 naira and above, Smart Connect they suffer me with free internet. Buy your address in today. Airtel, the smartphone network. Welcome back guys, it's time for a nasty comments where you get to, you folks get to read the nasty comments that people have left for you. Yes, you might have these people are your fans and they do love you, but um, yeah. they're just confused. No, fans is great and it's great and all. It's great and all. It's great and all. Although it's only because you imagine that with this kind of uh, order of perfection, anybody can still find something bad to say. Well, you know, let's see what we have to say. Let's just see. Yeah. So, there you go. Uh, so am I supposed to read everything? Please, you read out. Yes, please do your hand up. Harder die yours. Said, I think this guy should just stick to comedy because his rapping is whack, especially that Elope song. Total waste of envy. Hard day that your I think the first thing you need to do is reevaluate life. I don't know I remember the name that your parents gave to you because I don't know what this is supposed to mean. I mean, thank you for the criticism, even though I didn't agree with you. Thanks. To me, she following on show said, This guy should stop already with his jokes. They are getting old. Well, I mean, I don't know about this. Maybe your own sense of humor is different. But I think, you know, it's not very old. Not to me, anyway. Abby said, mm -hmm. I think I'm supposed to read this. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Right. This guy can't rap, Joe. The only reason why Elobe is popular is because of his jokes. Okay, well, thank you very much. I think, contrary to your belief, so many people out here believe that I'm a solid rap star. Thank Me you. too. I'm part of your Thank you very much. Thank you very much. EK for sure. See, the only good song this guy has sang is High Class. Others are crap. But thank you so much, uh, EK for sure. I think you should just uh, find out what you also want to do in your own life and then stop uh, identifying all these kind of things on board as well. I mean, I, generally, these are not really terrible comments. Mm -hmm. These are things I can take. Thank you so much for coming on the show today. I had so much fun with you. I tried not to laugh so much. Yeah, I am I, also so much excited to do this kind of bad bullshit. You know, you know, I have a nice time today. Mm -hmm. Thank you, that's really sweet. But before you get back to know your glasses, what is the inspiration behind it? Okay. Uh, it's yeah. like your trademark, right? Yeah, they, contrary to popular the guy is actually lens there, but it's invisible lens. So you may not see it. But it's there. Are you trying to call me crazy? Because there's no lens in that. If you can't see it, then you are not crazy. It's invisible lens, it's there. It's there. Anyway, the inspiration behind it is that uh, I mean, nobody out there is doing it. Everything I do, I try so much to be different. 
you know, you set my cell apart so you be staying there in every time you Is that right? Yeah, so that is what kind of portray movies and style. It's it's really creative. I haven't got over the fact that you called me crazy. No, 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 I, I didn't say that. I didn't say that. They may be. <laughs> so there's a possibility that I might be crazy. Okay. I mean, I'm not going to say it, you know, but positive. We will talk about that, but before we do, we're going to break to check out our top five. Top 5 Most Dangerous Animals in the World At number 5, Elephant The elephant, the largest land mammal, lives in Africa and some parts of Asia. Wild elephants sometimes enter villages and do damage to crush people. Around 500 people die by elephants every year. At number 4, Saltwater Crocodile The saltwater crocodile is the largest reptile in the world. The saltwater crocodile is powerful and fast, and its jaws can apply 3,000 pounds of pressure per square inch. Crocodiles kill up to 800 people every year. At number 3, African Lion. The African Lion has amazing speed, razor-sharp claws, and teeth to attack its prey. This dangerous animal has attacked people on farms and in cars at African safaris. Lions cause hundreds of fatalities a year. At number 2, Snakes Many species of snakes are dangerous to humans. More than 450 species are venomous and 250 are capable of killing a person. Most venomous bites occur in Africa, Asia and North America. And number 1 is Mosquitoes Mosquitoes make number 1 on the list of deadliest animals in the world. These small blood-sucking insects kill over a million people each year worldwide. It can spread diseases, most notably malaria. It can also spread elephantiasis, yellow fever, and West Nile virus. Friends, stay close. Friends in the tribe, stay closer. In the tribe, you always know what's up with Facebook, WhatsApp, Phoebe, and Twitter. There are no rules with SMS. It's endless. Enjoy very long conversations with that special someone. Enjoy endless connections to your friends with free calls, free WhatsApp, Twitter, Facebook, and BBM. You also enjoy up to 200% bonus on your recharges to call all networks. Migrate now by dialing star 312 hash and start a life. Endless connections. Airtel, the smartphone network. And that is all we have for you today. If you're wondering where Fongs is, I had to kill him for calling me crazy. That would trend much later. <laughs> but keep the conversation going on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook. Catch episodes of Trending brought to you by Airtel here every day, 9 a.m. and also 8 p.m. Thank you so much for watching and for being my audience. I love you. My name remains Nancy. Goodbye for now. I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> Thank you.